So, where'd you go? Oh, surprise me. Dup. Yes, my name is now officially The Magician, <laughs> and you will refer to me as such. <laughs> and you will treat the King of Spain with a lot of dignity as well. With all the respect her title deserves. <laughs> all right, where where are we going? What are we doing, well, Mr. Magician? We've got so many things we could do. Actually, no, this town's pretty cleared out. Uh, we could do that mission for Ranger Andy. Go check out the Ranger, Ranger Andy. I like how he has a camel back. <laughs> is, does he really have a water can, like, canteen yeah, on his back? Here, let's get him to come over here. See, there it is. Eh, he's got a, he's got a little valve on the top. Sure enough. We haven't met yet. You must be new in town. I'm Andy. Actually, we've been in town for quite a few days now. So, yeah, you, you just must have missed this, Ranger Andy. It's probably because you never go outside. Yeah, it's because you just stay in here all the time. Should I ask him if he... If I, if, if, is that insensitive to ask a veteran if they did something to their leg? <laughs> I think it's probably insensitive. Hey, Ranger Andy, I heard you were in the NCR. You ever kill anybody? Yeah, you ever kill anybody? How many times did you deploy? Did you ever kill anybody? Did you shoot someone? Pro tip, don't ask a veteran if they've ever killed anybody. They've heard it before, and the answer is always yes. A few years back, we get a tip that some Legion slavers were holed up in this burnout house a few clicks from where we were stationed. Oh, he said clicks. That's there, how you know he's deserted. in the military. No sign anyone's been there. I mean, nothing. As we're leaving... I hear something behind me. I turn around and there's this kid, just skin and bone, and he's looking up at us and he's scared half to death. Been hiding in a closet. He shuts himself back in the closet and that's when I see the grenade he's left by my feet. They do it a lot, the Legion, using kids. They know we'll hesitate. Anyway, that was the first time. Second time, I fell down those stairs in front of the motel. Just in case I got to thinking I'd put it all behind me. <laughs> What's the most embarrassing injury you ever had? Because I broke my arm falling out of bed. Um, I was chasing through, I was chasing someone through a hallway at school and I slid on the freshly waxed floor and drove my rib into a corner <laughs> and it bruised two of my ribs and it really, really hurt a lot. Yeah, Ranger Andy. So you have nothing, you can't even compare your injuries to ours. We've done a lot worse. And now we will go to Ranger Station Charlie. To Ranger Station Charlie. You know, one time I drank so much water that I vomited and my eyes started bleeding. I, I did like the same thing, only without the eyes bleeding. I drank so much water that I couldn't stop throwing up and I was shaking all the time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I would rather be dehydrated than overhydrated. Man, I've been both and none of them are fun. Neither one is fun, but at least when you're dehydrated, it's like... As long as you have water, you can just drink water if you're dehydrated. That was great music for a bunch of dead bodies. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. Disarm is mine. Yeah, we should probably turn off that music. It's kind of inappropriate. Change the station to Raining Blood by Slayer. <laughs> <laughs> Hope is not pleased with anything that just happened. I found some audio logs. Oh boy. Did you forget there's a landmine over there? I did forget there's a landmine under that body. It's okay, the body took literally all of the blast. I hear a bunch of flies. Probably in this toilet. Probably on the rotting corpses over here. Well, I guess, I mean, it has been like a few days. Wait, don't go- <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I saw you walking in there, and I'm thinking, I surely forgot. he hasn't forgotten about I've that tripwire. I completely forgot about the tripwire. I was looking for mines and not a tripwire. Uh, we found, like, all the information in here. We yep. just found the two tapes. There's so nothing let's... in here, so let's report back to Ranger Andy and let him know that all his friends are dead. Hooray! All my friends are dead! All my friends are dead! Well, I guess we'll start making our way to Boulder City then, yeah? Go to Boulder City. Yeah, we could do Boone's Quest later, or we could recruit him now if you want to do that. Nah, not really. Any word on Station Charlie? Ooh, I got word for you, but you're not gonna like it. What? What happened? Everybody there is dead. The Legion killed them. And I guess they stole their clothes for some reason. Those were good men at that station. Good men. This whole town was sleeping a lot easier because of them. Now, who knows what we're in for. The Legion? Christ. We'd be better off with raiders. Lucky well, you, we've got me. both. I know th Here, take this. Courtesy of the Ranger Veterans Fund. Let's see, you're just embezzling money from the Ranger Veterans Fund? Is there a Ranger Veterans Association we should be talking to about this behavior, Ranger Andy? 
We're idolized in Novak. Hooray, just in time to leave forever. Alright, so which way is Boulder's Colorado? Roughly the same direction as Boulder City, north of here. Oh, okay, so we'll go north. And here's rude young man. Rude young man and polite old lady. Yes, old lady Gibson. I guess she's hired a youngin since you don't come by enough anymore. I don't want her to want me to. <laughs> she's got that aching in her in her old crusty loins. In her geriatric loins. <laughs> you can hear the Gross. dust blowing around. Gross! <laughs> I don't want to know. I don't know. Have you ever had relations with a woman who is 30 years older than you? I've never had relations with anyone, Mike. <laughs> you have my sympathies. <laughs> Whoa, what's going on now? Uh, I think Big Dave might be back. I bet the game spawned another Big Dave. <laughs> Oh, he's mad at us. Is that a raider? Take him down. That's a Viper gunslinger. I keep hitting the top of the car. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Good job. 10 mil pistol. Why did I just take that? I don't need it. <laughs> I've been playing too much Fallout 4. I need to take everything. You're such a ruddy kleptomaniac. <laughs> yeah, I have to steal everything. I just fucking take your 10 mil pistol back. <laughs> In fact, have a second one, too, while you're at it. Have a second one. I don't care. That was the one you put all your accessories on, wasn't oh, it? Oh, crap, isn't it? I don't know which... Oh, there we go. Man, I don't want your pistol. I don't even want my own pistol. Who needs pistols, anyway? Who needs pistols, anyway? Fuck them. Hey, there's some ants down here. You wanna... Should I just let you take care of it for now? Yeah, I think I'm, I'm gonna handle this one. Oh, come on. Direct hit. If you are aiming for the ground... I'll get this eventually. There we go. Now we're dialed in. Just kind of... <laughs> what the hell? Oh, God, they're frenzied. They're burning each other. Oh, let's like, just let them work this out. You guys, you guys, you guys know what you're doing. <laughs> what the hell even was that? I guess we startled him so bad that he just jumped ten feet in the air. Oh, he was just like... <laughs> I hear gunfire. Is that Hope? I can't... Where did Hope go? That was a huge gun! Someone's over here... killing ants? And a plant. There we go. No more plant. I like this prospector guy. Maybe he'll join us. Maybe he'll be our companion. Maybe he will be. What the hell gun are you even shooting? He's just gonna walk directly across... Uh, is this Ipvana Lake? Yeah, the Ivana Lake bed. You just let him kill ants. Doesn't really matter. He, yeah, he'll, he can go crazy with those ants, man. Hey, welcome to the 188. Look at your favorite follower. Veronica, she's pretty cool. Man, I love my guns. I... I really... It's okay to love your guns, but it's not okay to love your guns. Hey, man, I don't judge. Love is love. Uh, you ever talk to this kid down here? Yeah, I have he's, talked to him a couple of times. He's a weirdo. <laughs> Let us have our fortunes told for 100 caps. Oh, boy. What do you want me to think about? I want to know what he says about you. Uh, sure. Think about me. You're playing the hand you've been dealt. But you don't let it rest. You shuffle and stack. And a gamble. A gamble that may pay off, but how? You said nothing interesting, actually. Yeah. I can't- I can't leave. Oh. <laughs> You're stuck in the dialogue? Yeah. <laughs> I- I can't leave. Somehow he has trapped me in his mind game. The forecaster has forecasted that you will give him another 100 caps. I... I don't want to. Sure. Uh <laughs> I can't leave. You're stuck. You're literally stuck in a... <laughs> <sighs> Never talk to that child ever again. Never talk to the forecaster. He's got mind control powers. He will force you to talk to him for eternity. Yeah. I'm gonna hide in this dumpster. I don't want to deal with life anymore. Is that your new home? You can stay in the dumpster all you want. I'll I have the room here. all to myself. Hope and I will stay in the room and you can live in the dumpster. Okay. I live here. I'll throw you a couple of dead rotting meats when I when I have them. Meat! 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 I like how she gave him a chair. Yeah, he's got a proper chair, but you see what she's sitting on? Oh, she's sitting on the Repcon rocket? Yeah, it's the, like the logo from the Repcon facility. Oh yeah, that's the O, isn't it? I think that, so, I'm not the, sure. That's the rocket logo from the Repcon facility we were yeah, just at. <laughs> that's, what she's, that's what she's using as a chair. 
I'm just going to assume he took it from her. <laughs> he took her chair. Now she has to sit on an he old He just rock. showed up one day, and she's like, oh, well, hello there, youngster. And he's like, give me that fucking chair. And she's like, oh, but this is where I sit. And then he just kind of like pushed her off the chair <laughs> and then just takes it and drags it around to the back. And she's like, I do love the young people. <laughs> Ew, is this how young people flirt nowadays? Oh, I'm so seduced. Gross. <laughs> what is your weird infatuation with her being seduced by young men? 